Are you living a conscious and awakened life? When I come back, I'll share with you some important benefits that come to us when we learn to awaken our consciousness. An awakened consciousness knows that all of creation is interconnected, that all of creation is just a simple unity, that everything in creation is interconnected and interdependent. In other words, everything we possess has been gifted and given to us. When we're able to embrace humility and a sense of gratitude, we recognize that everything we have, Everything we know and everything that sustains our existence has been given to us and it has come from outside of ourselves. For example, our birth, the air we breathe, the oxygen in the air, the sunlight and rain, the earth that grows our food, the knowledge that has been passed down to us, the wood we use to build the houses we live in, the technology we depend on, even the love, empathy, and compassion that gives our life meaning has all been gifted to us by someone else. The common ego belief that we are actually separate and independent beings is not only an illusion, it creates most of the anxiety and conflict that we experience in life. We tell ourselves that everything we have is ours. We earned it. We struggled for it. We worked for it. We created all of it. We are the center of the universe and we are entitled to have it. <laughs> At least that's what our primitive ego would like to believe. We tell ourselves that our beliefs represent absolute truth and we are always right. We know how the universe should function. We judge. We know our definition of the Creator is the correct and only truth. Our nation is the best nation. Our religion is the best religion. God takes care of us because we are special. Our tribe is the best tribe. We don't have to be thankful or grateful. We are entitled to what we've earned. We deserve to have it. We're strong, we're independent, and dependence is actually a weakness. Again, that's what our primitive ego would like to believe. But as we become more self-aware, and as we begin to awaken our consciousness, our worldview begins to change. We begin to see that our primitive ego is really very uncomfortable with weakness and dependence. We begin to see that powerlessness and helplessness are very frightening feelings for our primitive ego. The lack of control makes our primitive ego very anxious. As we mature and evolve our consciousness, we awaken to the amazing reality that dualistic, right and wrong, either or thinking is an illusion. It's an illusion created by and found only in the human mind. We awaken to the reality that all of creation is a single unity, a simple oneness. We begin to look at nature and we see nothing but an intricate web of relationships that unite and connect all of creation. We begin to realize and experience the fact that we're living conscious stardust. The day we awaken to those realizations, the entire universe begins to shift. We begin to experience a sense of awe. We begin to embrace humility. We become thankful and grateful for everything that we have. We begin to reach out and connect with the world in new ways. Instead of simply taking from the world, we begin to give to the world. Beliefs that fail to lead to an increase in compassion are dropped. 
We begin to care for our planet and the other life forms that coexist with us. We begin to care for others and seek to add value to their lives. Not because it's the kind, compassionate thing to do, but rather because we understand that we're all interconnected. We're all interdependent on one another. And what we offer to others, we're offering to ourselves. We look up at the stars ablaze in a clear night sky, and we know that we're an interconnected part of an amazing interconnected mystery and oneness that we call our universe. And we become thankful and grateful to be an awakened, conscious part of that mystery.